I'm gonna say, oh, I'm gonna say Cabal. I think Cabal is it. Damn it. All oh, right, hello everyone. It is Mr. Punkwitz from Everyone Bound. We're here with another random roulette. Uh, you'll never believe it. New season, new weapons. That means random roulette's coming back. Of course it does. Uh, we have ourselves all of the, or not all of it. We have a, a good handful of the uh, new seasonal uh, weapons. Not the Vex ones yet. Uh, you know, still gotta earn them. Gotta actually play the game to earn those ones, so it's a little bit harder to get. Uh, but honestly, like, I'm not that mad about it because uh, these ones aren't half bad themselves. But either way, we have the pulse rifle. We have the. I forgot it was a secondary or energy weapon. We have the trace rifle. And we have the linear fusion with all the perks that are mentioned there. I know one of them has attrition, and uh, this one actually has a really cool combination where it's uh, uh, what's it called? Consistent damage lets you uh, lets you do more. What, what I trying to say? It's for consistent damage to let, lets you do more precision damage, and then it also has um, whenever I do class ability, I can change the uh, type, which doesn't help right now because I'm fucking uh, void anyways. But still, very cool. And I don't remember what this perk, uh, what this perk. I don't remember what this pulse has at the top of my head. But uh, I do just like the weapon by itself, so uh, that, that's got to be worth something, right? I feel like it's been about 20 years since I found a pulse from a season that I uh, kind of latch onto, and uh, this feels like that one. Although I could be wrong. I could just be massively misremembering. Mis 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 oh my god, misremembering. I can't talk today. Obviously, uh, you know, aesthetic-wise, they're, uh, they're a certified banger, like always. Uh, I thought I was going to get sick of seeing... Queen, uh, what's it called, like, Queen-adjacent weapons, Dreamy City uh, style weapons. Because, uh, I mean, even though Dreamy City weapons are all different, they still kind of have a similar style. Uh, but, you know, I honestly really do like this uh, this look here. I, I think still, I still think the fucking absolute best is the season of Defiance weapons, the, the blue ones. I'm pretty sure that's Defiance. Uh, those ones are still absolutely, in my opinion, the undisputed best. But, you know, these ones ain't half bad either. Anyway, let's fucking deposit some shit. This is the weirdest game. I've noticed a trend. I was trying to... I was grinding a little bit of uh, Gambit on night one, or me and Joel were, and I noticed that people play Gambit very differently nowadays. Or maybe I just never noticed it before and I'm only noticing it now, but it feels like people hold their modes a lot more compared to, uh, like, back in the day. What? What the fuck? Okay. I was like, why am I not reviving you? Yeah, I don't know if that's just a, a thing I've noticed recently, and it's uh, always been a thing, or if it's uh, a new uh, thing that people are doing since the game is, like, not very popular, so people are finding new strategies to uh, make the games go by faster, but it's just uh, something weird that I noticed. I don't, I, don't, I don't hate trace rifles as much as I feel like I used to. I'm having a lot of fun with this trace rifle. Wifle? I'm having a lot of fun with this waste rifle, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, okay. Are these guys gonna invade? There it is. I am dead as a doornail. I really thought. Oh my god. I'm so fucking dead. Leave. Leave, please. I beg of you. Thank you. Okay, holy crap. That was the most. That was the weirdest fucking uh, invader fight I've ever been a part of. Now that I got this, though, I can plant. And we're good to go. Yeah, overall, a solid set of weapons. I'm not gonna lie. I, uh. I've only. I mean, I've only been using the pulse when it comes to, uh, like, you know, random PV content. But, um, it's, uh, ooh, exotic, but it served you well. Like I said, it's just a, it's a nice, uh, like, fast fire rate pulse rifle, and I'm all, I'm all down for those. I can't wait to see how it plays in Crucible if I ever go back to the Crucible. You know, maybe I'll, uh, do that in the checkmate video that's eventually gonna come out. Now that checkmate is, like, the only control. I, I, okay, I'm not gonna lie, that was me being just fucking stupid. That was just me being straight up dumb. First game of the day is my excuse. Uh, not a good one. I'm trying to search my pulse, or my, uh, trace rifle, but that obviously didn't work. I just feel I feel fucking dumb in Destiny. I don't know if that makes any sense, but I just feel like I, my my I like my Destiny IQ has just dropped to fucking zero over the last few months. That's probably another reason why I don't play it as much, besides the fact that I feel like I'm just kind of getting a little uh, tired. I guess I don't know. I'm, I'm just kind of ready for the final shape to happen, so uh, I'm just kind of like I feel like I'm saving up all my mental energy for that. Like, why would you spawn there? Unironically, why? There's no reason why you should spawn in cliffs when half our fucking team is in cliffs unless you just weren't there and i'm just insane that this is such a fucking weird game whatever i don't know i think i think i'm growing fond of trace rifles just because of how long it's been since i've actually had to since i've actually used one consistently i would not be mad if like next season or next episode or whatever the fuck whenever we get a new meta update for uh, artifacts uh, i would not be mad if we got a uh, a new trace rifle uh, like buff where they suddenly become meta they're just fun to use. I know they're mindless because it's just laser, like, boss win, but, like, I don't know. Something about that's kind of, uh, nostalgic and kind of nice. 
And there we go. Okay. What a match. Okay. Uh, wow, you are pretty. Just straight off the bat, I'm going to go ahead and call you pretty. Because you are good looking. Um, and Spaghetti Johnson. I can't... I Oh, fuck you. I hate when they're pretty and good at the game. I just hate that. Alright, see you in the next match. I almost forgot. Uh, we're switching this match. We're switching to the shotgun. The super cluster. This was the uh, the appetence. Appetence? 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 I don't know. This is the this is the straight survival with uh, overflow wellspring. This pulse has uh, keep away attrition and this uh, doomed petitioner. This f uh, linear fusion has perme permeability and precision instrument. Please, destiny people, per perk name people, uh, make it easier for me. Because I feel like the longer this game goes, the harder the perk names are getting. Okay. Love to see it. I've n I cannot tell you the last time I joined into a game of progress on Gambit. Holy shit. I, this is the first time I pulled out this shotgun and like actually looked at it. Because I, I basically got it and then fucking hopped off. But uh, wow, this is... Uh, oh, this is this is familiar actually. What, what, what model is this? This is... I know this. This is from something, I swear. Oh, either way. Uh... Is it was it Forsaken? Was there a, a crucible shotgun I think that maybe looked like this? The wish wish wishbone something wish? I don't know. I think I think I'm insane. Uh, my like my fucking destiny memory brain is just ticking off right now trying to figure out what it, what it's from. But uh, either way, it's a beefy looking shotgun. Not gonna lie. What I want to know is is this one of those ones that you want full auto on, or is this one of those ones that are like precision frame, but look like a fucking block of cheese? Drop a 15 footer on them. Show them I joined the lobby. Like, seriously, look at this thing, dude. Holy fuck, I wish I could inspect. Because that is that is a disgustingly fat uh, shotgun. I'm just I'm just walking up, stealing everyone's fucking moats, and then walking away. Zero kills, 20,000 20, 20, moats. Ooh, okay. Okay. I actually like the beef that comes with this fucking shotgun. Does not look like it's pre precision frame, though. You can always tell how good a fusion, uh, linear fusion is going to be by the... By how trash its fucking sights are. None of those hit? Alright. You know, that, that might be on me. That's probably on me. I'm gonna blame that on the fact that I've been playing COD religiously for the past three weeks now, but, um... No excuses. I do really like this shotgun. I did not expect to like it that much. Like, I wasn't really thinking about these weapons when it, in regards to, like, you know, actual hunts, but, um... Because I like, I'm gonna be honest. I was, I'm really only focused on the undying weapons. That's all I care about. I miss those things so dearly, and I'm so happy to see them back. Okay, so this thing doesn't have a range from that. But yeah, that's what I was most excited about was the undying weapons. But um, like honestly, not bad. Maybe I'm just too optimistic about weapons. Just gonna run at me with a fucking heavy. I don't know what to expect anymore. Yeah, even though these these things are never replaced, they uh, never take the place of the uh, weapons that I actually care about, the weapons that I'm actually look for, looking forward to from the season, uh, aka the undying weapons, um, they're they're still not terrible, not gonna lie. And I should probably try to get some good rolls for this. But I, I really want to look into getting uh, some good rolls for this pulse. I can't wait to see what this thing can actually roll with, because uh, I am I am very interested. All right, so what's gonna happen here is that we're gonna get this guy down a little bit, and then uh, they're gonna come in and invade us and uh, fucking squad wipe us to get them get us back to full health permeable. And then we're going to do the same. And it's going to be a forever game. It's either that or we're about to get fucking dick stomped. Dick flattened. I'm legitimately the worst linear fusion rifle user of all time. Un unironically. I need, to get, I need to go to fucking... I need to go back to school. For specifically linear fusion rifles. Actually, to be, to be fair, I fucking hate the sights on this thing. The, the sights might genuinely kill this weapon as a fucking viable option for me. Not to say I wouldn't, I'm actually just going to use my fucking uh, linear fusion from duality, but still that what a fucking i don't know what it is about it sites are so goddamn important like obviously first person shooter sites are important duh but like i don't know I've, I've noticed that more and more how much iron sights or how much fucking bad sites in general could just fucking kill a weapon for me completely oh we lost that is so unfortunate man fuck oh we got a break deck let's go okay so i already do have one but on oh we got one with onslaught let's go holy shit this is actually so massive this makes up for everything Okay, well, that's the next random roulette, so, uh, we'll, we'll, you know, undying weapons and then that, but either way, let's fucking go. This is, like, a super petty thing, but I got fucking best dress, best dress at the end of that uh, fucking game, game, and I fucking hate that, because this is, like, the laziest looking guardian, like, hunter of all time. Like, genuinely, I, like, the more I look at it, the more generic it feels, uh, and I still consistently get best dress. I feel so fucking bad for all the, like, hunters that are really going out there and, like, experimenting with fashion, and I'm just sitting here with a fucking cowboy hat and getting best dress. Like, it's, it's, so, it's such fucking trash. 
Uh, but either way, that's a total side tangent. These guys. Well, first we're gonna go back to the trace level, but yeah, let's fucking let's start talking about these guys. So these guys can actually run. Or sorry, starting with the trace level, this guy can actually run with some pretty cool perks, uh, in my opinion. Like deconstruct, one for all, uh, like attrition orb stuff like that. That's really cool damage perks for the trait for a trace rifle. And killing tally, obviously, I forgot about killing tally. And it can also run really cool like ammo attachments to give you more ammo, like overflow or fucking uh, or clown cartridge. So honestly, like I think this thing this thing can be a really good like sustained fire extra damage uh really like old-fashioned not old-fashioned uh cold heart style uh trace rifle so uh honestly I, uh, like if you need a trace i don't know why you need a trace rifle i'm sure there are already good ones out there that i just don't know about uh probably like a dungeon one or a raid one or something but uh, either way i i i you know not terrible for the rolls it, it can uh, roll with moving on to the super cluster i still don't know what to think about this thing to be honest i still don't understand if it's like a oh it's a, a slug frame okay so that answers that question i just looked at the loot pool and it can run fucking reconstruction which is insane i i kind of thought that'd say on fucking raid weapons forever or deep stone crypt weapons forever uh, unless it's already been on weapons that i just haven't noticed because you know i'm not really the i'm not the perk guy so i don't know but uh, reconstruction on this thing was, would obviously be amazing can also get a perk called fragile focus which i actually didn't know to, know about as a perk uh, until until looking at the fucking weapon uh or like perk combination list for this weapon more damage whenever you have full shields uh i think that could come in handy if you're uh, if you're an accurate shotgun user so i think that'd be kind of uh, good uh, moving on to this guy i take back what i said i don't think this thing really has a lot of good roles maybe i'm just not looking at it the right way or looking at it in specifically the old style of like perks of what you actually want but really all i see that's like amazing on this weapon would be like golden tricorn or stuff like focus fury or over under stuff like that that can really help because it has like such a fucking i was gonna say it's such a big magazine but it really doesn't compared to the uh god damn it what was that weapon from season of the chosen chosen no what was the season with Kaido? whatever season Kaido came in uh, that's still that has like way more magazine so i guess you'd still probably just want to use that thing uh so yeah kind of disappointing this thing to be honest i thought this thing would have a lot more and uh, i never do heavy things because i honestly don't know but honestly uh precision precision instrument as a uh, as a perk sounds very fucking cool to me so uh, if you can get that on other weapons i didn't see it on any of the ones that i looked at for this but uh like assuming you can uh yeah i'd say go for that yeah so that's that's that uh interesting looking weapons i think cool uh weapons but uh i don't know if i would uh like, I, man, I, I am heartbroken that this Pulse Rifle doesn't have that many good rolls that I could uh, really work with. They're rolls that I don't really like. Uh, that is that is so disappointing to me because I was really looking forward to uh, grinding out a good roll for this. Although, maybe I still will. Maybe I'll do a roll out revisited someday. Someday, later this season, uh, with a better roll that I uh, can actually show off more. Anyways, that was a random roll out. And uh, this is Mr. Punk was from Heavy One Bound signing out. I will see you guys next time.